da Another being Ace, the one who created the New York City subway on trains and the one who calls all the shots for New York City subway development on trains. Another is based off one of my co-workers and a friend of mine. Fire hydrants in the station. Now you guys know where the name comes from. The Twin Towers can be found in the outside world at the World Trade Center station on the T train. Although the R train crosses the Williamsburg Bridge, since it runs on Flatbush Avenue and then Canal Street, it's tech. The 2, 3, 4, and 5 trains share tracks with B Division trains A, C, N, Q, and P trains at some point in their journey. When these two trains run together, get the pun, there's a meteorite that crash landed on Governor's Island. A piece of the Great Wall of China can be spotted in New York Harbor, Cedar Hill. The last stop on the L train represents an endless mountain. Marble Hill is part of Manhattan in real life. It's considered part of the Bronx in the outside world. New Jersey can be explored in the outside world at Fort Washington Park by crossing the bridge. Ironically, the real George Washington Bridge can be spotted right under
2, 3, and 6 trains are allowed to reach speeds up to 120 miles per hour at some point in their journey. The W and 1, however, are only allowed to reach up to 100, and the others are limited to 50. Here's a bonus one for you guys. A B-46 stop makes an appearance in the outside world at Empire Boulevard, Utica Avenue. It has a stop there in real life. 